one, we got Raymond Parker, some people do connections with the snake, young form engineers, and the debris, and so the filming. So we also are uh, working with the state to make sure that we can do right about 25 miles. And then we're going to go already. Yeah, so uh, a lot of it's out of the way, but this is the secondary stuff. and so you've already you've already given us a couple of different degree crews to right. help out with our utilities and facilities, and uh, we're going to be responsible for coming up with the state level. But, but everything we've asked for out of the you guys can provide. We've already registered over 20,000 communities in the individual systems in that number one So you get you authorized to first check the students yesterday. I think we're today. What's that? Temporary assistance later. Yep, so we're, we're going to try to move people. The goal is to get people out of shelters into more livable situations, whether it's hotels or uh, areas that we can rent. Um, and we're looking at longer term housing missions with the governor and how we're going to do that. And they think there's some, uh, since, since Panama City Beach was not this hard, they think there's some place they could be But you guys, I mean, the time you took to do this was up to you. So I just want to thank you for Always being there, taking my phone calls and calling me. And uh, I think you're for saying Brock down. Brock down almost every day. Okay, we're start moving to our right. Let's keep going.
Somebody said it was like a very wide, you mean extremely wide tornado, because that's really what this was. This was beyond any winds that they've seen. I guess 50 years, but who knows? It could have been longer than that. Nobody's seen anything. So they've done a great job. I want to thank you. I've had the opportunity every day to talk to the president, and uh, I've talked to Brock a lot, and everything I've asked the president for, FEMA has come through. They have a lot of work to do. We're still getting water out and getting food out. Our search and rescue teams have done a great job getting around the state. Highway Patrol, our National Guard, uh, everybody. We called up 4,000 members of the National Guard. They're working day and night. We've got local law enforcement crews coming to augment our, lo our uh, uh, local law enforcement. We've got a great sheriff here. I'm not sure where he is. But we're going to do everything we can to get this community back to work. And I want to thank the president for always taking my call and uh, showing up. And I want to thank the First Lady for being here and showing your support for the, the people here in Panama City. And I just want to say the governor of Florida, Rick Scott, has done an unbelievable job. Uh, everybody, we're meeting hundreds of people along with you, and uh, they're all talking about the great job the governor's doing and everybody is doing together. Everybody. So, Rick, I want to thank you. It's been great coordination. Thank you. thank you all very much. Right. We're seeing a lot of hurricanes now. How does this one strike this, this us? Never, I've never looked behind you. I mean, these massive trees are just ripped out of the earth. We've seen mostly water, and water can be very damaging and horrible and scary, you know, when you have. When you see water rising 14, 15 feet, but nobody's seen anything like this. This is, this is really incredible. And the job they've done, first responders, FEMA, the job they've done is incredible. This road, five hours ago, you couldn't ride on it. And today, you, you see the trees are all pushed. Today, we're having not much of a problem. Pretty amazing job. How are you prioritizing providing relief? Well, we're going to do a lot, and we're doing a lot for Florida. We're now going to Georgia. Georgia was hit very hard. But uh, when you look, and I think the governor will tell you we're doing a lot, we are doing more than anybody would have ever done. And probably there hasn't been hits like this, certainly not very often. They say 50 years ago, there was one that had this kind of power. 50 years ago, that's a long time. Uh, but we're helping the people, and we will always help the people. We're helping your great governor. How are, Thank you all. How are you prioritizing providing relief for these victims? We have the maximum relief. Uh, we've called the maximum relief. We're doing everything we have to do. Yes. How are you? Look at this man. How are you? Good, sir. Nice to see you. Thank you very much. You take care. Everything okay? Uh, we're, we're volunteers. Good. Yes. Yeah, this is all volunteers coming together. To put this this is, together isn't right that here. beautiful? This state has great Thank people put, coming together to help each other. Thank you for doing they really are. These are great people. Thank you. Sir. Thank you. Thank you. Guys, we're going to hold right here. Don't move. Hold here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 